What's going on guys? Welcome back to Super Mario Odyssey. Last time my friends we explored the beautiful city of New Donk where Pauline is the mayor today. We're making our way to the next kingdom. We have to say farewell to the Metro Kingdom. I mean we'll be back soon enough but this is it. We'll, we'll be gone for a good while I guess. I mean holy crap I never really looked at it like this from this angle. There's literally skyscrapers in every corner. This is like five New York cities fused into one. It's kind of ridiculous. So today we're making our way to the next kingdom of this game but before we begin you all know the drill. Demolish that like button. Let's get this episode to exceed 2,000 likes and don't forget to answer the comment question of the day. Last time I asked you guys what is your favorite kingdom that we currently visited so far. Here are some of the responses that we got today's comic question of the day is would you rather get another new super mario bros game for the nintendo switch of course or would you rather get a super mario 3d world themed game for the nintendo switch for me definitely a game that's similar to super mario 3d world because i'm a big fan of you know open world adventure mario games and co-op games of course i mean 3d world was practically the best nintendo wii game there was there is and most likely there ever will be uh, it's it's truly a masterpiece not dissing like new super mario bros games though i mean they're very similar kind of repetitive when you play the first like when you play them all i guess you'll see the similarities between them but 3d world was super refreshing and uh i mean that game just did really well even like in terms of views on youtube it just does so well because you know it's it's a very refreshing game and, and it's unfortunate because we might never see a game like it again but i shouldn't be a pessimist i should stay hopeful that nintendo will Maybe, you know, make another game like that hopefully soon in the future. Now that they got the technology to do it, I don't see why they wouldn't. I mean, it's just extra money for them to make. And, you know, obviously more gameplay for us to do or play because, you know, who doesn't want to have a good time, a good adventure with Mario and the gang? And by the gang, I mean your friends. But look at that, 93 power moons. This is awesome. We're almost at 100. I was told by one of my brothers who beat the game already that you need 300 power moons to actually beat the game uh obviously they're oh we get a pick between two different kingdoms look at this we had a proverbial fork in the road which kingdom do you think bowser went to well obviously he's gonna be in the kingdom that we're not gonna go to so i'm gonna say i want to do i want to do the snow kingdom i think the snow kingdom would be fun to do i'm feeling a little bit of snow today it's not really like snowy outside or anything but i guess i can you know experience snow in this game it's like it's almost november believe it or not back in like 2005 2006 whenever uh october would come around it would actually snow a lot like very very much and then november snow a lot more and then december it would be horrible because it would be so much snow everywhere that you couldn't do anything you couldn't go outside you couldn't drive anywhere you had to shovel snow and i mean come on as a little kid who, would, who wants to shovel snow? It's tough. It's tough work. Bowser sure was promoting his own wedding in a rather vulgar fashion. Let's hurry on and save those two. Seeing as how we've got some time to kill, let's review some useful skills. All right, what do you got today for me? Long jump. Oh my gosh, tell me. Please, I would love to know about this super magnificent long jump. Oh my goodness. I just noticed their cups, dude. They're like top hats. That's amazing. Everything is top hat themed. Even their drawers. They have top hats on them. Even like the drawer handle is a top hat. This is crazy. Even the thing that holds the curtains are top hats. Dude, you are obsessed with yourself. This guy's a total narcissist, for real. Run, crouch, and then jump. You'll do a long jump and sail ahead. Well, there it is. Let's check out the Snow Kingdom next. Urgh, it looks cold, and it sounds like the races in town are quite popular, and its prize is a forest frosted cake. Ooh, that sounds delicious. If I know Bowser, he's gonna need a cake for his wedding. And what better cake to have than a forest frosted cake? I don't know actually if you would want a forest frosted cake. That doesn't sound good at all. I mean, my ideal cake is carrot cake, but I know most people don't like it. I'm a big fan of carrot cake though. It's delicious. Probably not a cake you would want at your wedding though. The Cake Thief Parting Gift. They have a gift for me? I'm gonna, what the heck? Look at Mario. My boy is shivering. He's like, oh, I can't do this. Let's not dilly dally. Okay, whatever. Fine. I could be a Goron. Look at that. I'm just, you know, rolling around like Sonic the Hedgehog or a Goron from The Legend of Zelda. Either or. Doesn't matter. Whatever you want it to be. Wow. Look at this place, man. You can hardly see because of how much snow is outside. 
I mean, this is probably what the North Pole is like. Oh, look at that. It's a nice whirlwind pushing me up. A nice gust of wind. That's the last thing you would need in such a cold place like this. I love the effect that it has on Mario. Like, look at that. You can see, like, Mario shivering. You can see the snow, like, on his outfit. It's not totally covering him, but it gives him enough snow to, like, make his appearance look different. Um, I said it gives him enough snow. It's just... It's just oh, gosh! Cold water! This is how people die. This is how you get, um... Oh, no, no, no! Hypothermia and die. You don't want that. Okay, I'm literally not finding anything here. What is going on? Like, this is weird. You would think I'd find, like, at least a coin or something. And I'm talking about purple coins, not these kinds of coins. Hey, look at that. There's something in there. Um, it looks like it could be a, a power moon. Did I hear something? What the heck? It's a hole! It's a giant ditch. It just led me into something. Okay. Well, we, we didn't find anything, and we already made our way here. Uh, Shaviria Town. This is the place. I don't know. I don't know what this place is. It's probably the town for this, this map or this area. Look at that, dude. We found a nice power moon. You got a moon. All right. That's pretty cool. Can I actually bust down these boxes? Probably so. Let's try it. Oh, gosh. No, 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 no. Not like that. There you go. Land on the boxes. I'm going to get on the top one right here. Mario's still shivering, dude. I need an outfit. I'm pretty sure I already know what the outfit's going to be in this game. It's going to be the Eskimo outfit. Look at these cute little things, dude. They're like chubby little walrus. And, you know, these, uh... It looks like the... the what is that thing? That Chinese uh, finger catcher? I don't know what it's called, but there's a thing. It's like this, uh... This thing that you, like, put on your finger, and then you, somebody else puts it on their finger, and then they're stuck together forever. The more you pull, you know, the harder it is to break out of it. It's actually a real thing, but... I don't know, that's what it looks like they have on their, their hands, their arms. I'm keeping my arms warm! You'd think these walrus would be, be okay. Hey, what's up? Give me a tip! It's talk talk to. What is the secret you're seeking? I know it, I know it. Ha, I can't tell you, but I'll give you a clue. Shopping in Shivaria. I don't know how to pronounce that. It's hiding somewhere and no peeking. Go find it. Scraw! Let's not do that. I don't have enough coins. I mean, I'll go back to it once I have enough purple coins because I want to make sure I have enough to buy the outfit. Oh, look at this. Wind chill cavern. Oh! What the heck is wrong with you, bro? Give me a heads up that you're going to blow me like that. It's unacceptable. All right, I'm gonna do this again. Oh, I'm gonna hit him. Oh, I could probably... Oh, no! See, look at him, dude. He's like, hey, you don't like that? Well, that's fine. I could go ahead and do this, too, though. Man, I know this is from Super Mario 3D World. That's what I remember him from. Oh, why did I let him do that? Like, I literally faced him the wrong direction. And there's two more. All right, that's fine. I'm gonna just chillax right here. Oh, gosh, that almost made me fall. I think I need to take his, you know, Santa hat off and... Do the same thing right here. Woohoo! Very nice! Alright, let's get out of here. Is, I'm surprised I'm not seeing any purple coins. Okay, I see them. Look at them! They're actually in the shape of snowflakes. I didn't notice that. Just now I did. I don't know why I didn't notice it when I saw it, but... They're snowflakes! That's pretty cool. It's very neat, actually. Look at all these spikies, dude. They're all trying to come at me? Are you serious? I'm gonna blow you all away. Very nice! We got a moon power. Power moon for doing that. I'm gonna just quickly, you know, take a little trip over here. These things aren't floating in the, uh... Can I jump with this thing? No, you can't. No, no, stop. Stop, Mario. Don't do this. That's not cool. So they're literally just hovering over the poison gas. This is such an odd place for them to be in. I can't tell if that gas is, like, cold or if it's bubbling because it's boiling. I don't know. Let's see what happens when I stand here. Mario's still cold, so obviously it's not warm. There's no warmth whatsoever emanating from those things. Whoa, look at that war pipe. The attention to detail is so crazy. It's like a really raggedy old war pipe. Look at that, dude. Uh-oh, what happened? Whoa, a Bowser plate. All right. Whoa, look at that lag, dude. This game hasn't lagged at all, and this is the first lag we've ever experienced on the game. The energy of the power moon seems to open those barriers. That's right. So which room did we actually enter in? I think it was that one? Yeah, so let's go ahead and take a different path. Let's go this way. We only need 10 power moons, by the way, so this is actually a shorter kingdom. It's a good thing that I did this. I'm doing, like, one short kingdom, one long kingdom. That's just how it is. Is there something here? Probably a power moon? Maybe? Probably some Goombas, dude. 
I don't know. Why is it lagging like that? It's a coin. This entire thing was just for a coin, man. I'm kind of depressed. I was hoping it would be something more. All right. Um, let me go ahead and backflip. Oh, yeah. There you go. 14 coins. I'm almost there. I just need, like, a couple more. Actually, I literally need one more, and I should have enough to get the outfit for this place. And I'm going to go do it right now after this place. Woohoo! Look at me! Spinning like a little birdie! In the sky. Awesome. Let's go ahead and pull it off. Do it again! Woohoo! Uh oh. Wait, what? Bowser's Koopalings, aka the Brutals? They're here? What are they doing here? Hey, what's up, dogs? I already beat you all. Who's gonna fight me again? Haha, -ha, we got the Frosted Frosted Cake! The Forest Frosted Cake. The boss Bowser, man, is fussy about cake. Reckon we get him the best one, though. So why, why are they working for Bowser? Are they really, like, that desperate for a job? I don't know. Maybe these are, like, the baddest villains of the Cap Kingdom. What the heck, dude? I literally screwed up because this stupid thing is slippery. I guess that's the penalty for not having the proper equipment for this place. All right, go ahead. Bust open. Let's see if I can get, like, a, a, a heart. Hey, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Okay, there you go. We got a heart. I want it. Give me the heart. All right, now I just got to hit these things again. No, that totally failed. All right, go ahead. Do it again. Do it again, sucker boy. Oh, yeah. Look at that. That was perfect. And then I'm going to boom, sucker, land on your head. I don't think these guys are going to give me multi-moons. Maybe it's because I already beat them once. I already got all the multi-moons from them. But let's just hope. Oh, no. Leave me alone, you stupid Beyblade. All right, here he comes again with this fancy hat attack. And then I'm going to just land on your head. Woohoo! Suck on that. You know, I'm actually kind of disappointed that I let him hit me once. It's not like I'm beating them no damage like all of the bosses, but still. It was unacceptable because Mario's slipperiness threw me off. But look at that, guys. We got ourselves another power moon, just like I thought. I, I knew it was going to be one power moon because, you know, obviously I saw the platform there and it was one power moon, you know. Not a multi-moon, but it's all good, man. We already got our multi-moons from them, so I got nothing to complain about. Once again, lag. Why? The game shouldn't lag, dude. It's kind of sad. It's disappointing. It's like in Breath of the Wild, man. It's almost a perfect game if it didn't lag. I'm just kidding. It's still a perfect game. Just like this game is. Truly, if you have not played this game, you should definitely eventually try to play it. Oh, gosh. What the heck are those things? What is that? They kind of remind me of those sand things from Super Mario 3D Land that come out of the sand whenever they're beneath you. Whoa, look at that, dude. They're just like giant pillars. It's like Pac-Man. It's like a game of Pac-Man right now, you know? We're just running away from, you know, the ghosts. Oh, no! Oh, leave me alone! Oh, no, leave me alone, please! They really want to grab a bite of Mario. I don't think that's a good idea. Mario needs to go to the bathroom, so you're going to end up, uh, oh, no, putting yourself in a really nasty situation here. All right, I'm going to just let him stand on me. There you go. Oh, gosh. Yeah, I get, I get it now. What you're supposed to do is not let him bite you. That's, that's the one thing you're not supposed to do. All right, there you go. See? Just not let him bite you. Oh, no. All right, let's do it again. Woohoo. All right. Oh, gosh. What the heck, dude? I need to land on him. Land on him. There you go. Oh, man, I need to probably use uh, Cappy to get that last one. I mean, I could obviously get it by jumping, but I just get a little scared. Oh, man, this is not good. All right. There you go. We got it with Cappy. Now I just got to get over this way. Oh, no. These things are really screwing me up, dude. Oh, no. There you go. Fine. I made it. All right. All right. Let me go. Oh, no. This is crazy. I'm gonna die. Woohoo! What the heck, Mario? Grab onto it! You clown! There you go. I don't know what he was doing, man. I was losing control of everything that I was doing. I felt like I was possessed. Maybe, you know, that's what happened to me. Another guy with a cap possessed my Mario and my cap, and therefore I was under his command. But another plate has moved. How many of these things are there? How many of these do we got to move, brother? Oh, yeah, I forgot. I totally didn't go back and get the, uh, the, uh, the, the, the outfit. Only one barrier to go. That's right. One barrier left before we can make our grand escape. 
So hold on a second. There it is. The crazy cap shop over here. So I'm gonna go ahead, like I said, and buy the outfit for this place. And then I'm gonna also buy me. What else am I gonna buy? That's right. I'm gonna buy a power moon. Look at that. The snow hood. A down hood that keeps the cold from making you bitter. After decades of ice levels, finally a good warm jacket. That's right. Finally, dude. Mario, like, never felt pain in his life. He doesn't know what it's like to feel cold. But in this game, Nintendo was like, we're gonna change that. Mario, you've had it easy your entire life. Now you will experience cold once in your, you know, I guess, amazing career. Hey, look at him! Nice and fashionable. Kinda looks like an ice climber, almost. I mean, anything with a hood looks like an ice climber. Like a nice, fluffy hood like that. Much thanks, you're welcome. I appreciate you, walrus. Here we go! Is what he would say if this were Mario 64. But yes, we got five power moons. So now we have two more power moons remaining. Or I mean, uh, three more, five more. How did I get two from five, dude? What the heck? I'm silly goose today. I'm gonna, gonna grab that. So which is the last room that we need to enter in? I think it's this one, maybe. I don't know. Maybe it's this one. Oh, yeah, it is this one. What's up, guys? I got I got a little something for you. Oh, no, 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 no! Why did I kill him? I should have let him live. Oh, gosh, this is crazy. I'm too slippery, man. I need the Goombas. You know, I, I for some reason, was thinking that I needed to jump on them to possess them, but I just need to do this. There you go. Oh, leave me alone. I said it. I said it. Leave me alone. There you go. So, apparently, if you stand underneath one of these icicles, an icicle will come falling down. Have you ever seen an icicle in real life? They're kind of scary. Because it's like, wow, this is a very sharp piece of frozen water. Like, something as soft and as harmless as water can kill you. But then again, you know, anything can. Even the very air that you breathe can kill you if it's poisonous. You know, I'm just getting really dark right now. But, hey, what did we find? A power moon! Yay! Easy for me. Ice dodging Goomba stack. That's right. So what? Do I have to, like, keep this stack with me the entire time as I play through this? Probably so. I mean, let's let's be real here. These guys are fantastic. They have, like, their, uh... They, they don't have slippery feet like Luigi or Mario. I don't know how it happens, but... Maybe they have, like, suction cups on their shoes or something, you know? It just sucks on the ice. And then it makes it so they don't slip. All right, we're gonna go through here and then wait for him. There you go. Very nice. Awesome. Boom, bada, bing. There you go. We made it, guys, all the way to the top. Um, uh oh, watch out. No! Oh! Actually, I want to see what happens if I let one of these guys get squished. Yeah, come here. Don't you want to get squashed? No, nah, he doesn't. Wow, he saved himself. Lucky little dude. You literally would have died because of me. But I let- Oh gosh, he's gonna try to kill me. Look at that, dude. Just a giant ice cone falling from the sky. Alright, so obviously there's, uh... There's something up here. Let me go ahead and grab it. Oh gosh, oh gosh, leave me alone. Can these things reach me? They can! This is not good. They're really gonna try to wreak havoc on me this time around. Oh no! Leave me alone! Hey, we did it, guys! We got ourselves another power moon. So now, I think we activated that Bowser, uh, area. Something special is going on down there. But I guess we'll have to find out. Ooh, look at that, man. Very nice. The Bound Bowl Grand Prix. What? The Bound Bowl Grand Prix? Please explain to me what I just said. I don't know. I don't know what a Bound Bowl is. Is it like some kind of animal? Are these Bound Bowls? Maybe that's the name of their sport. I have no clue. We'll find out though. Woohoo! Mario sliding. What if they made like a a power? Oh, look at this. What if they made a, a power moon like um Princess Peach's secret castle? That would be pretty nice. Snow line circuit. What the heck, dude? What are these things? Mmm, can't start without one more racer. I'm here. I'm a racer, dude. Dude, look at his outfit. It's so fluffy looking. It's like, it reminds me of Yoshi's Epic Yarn. Look at these guys. You have different color ones. We need one racer to start. Yeah. Hey, where's the last racer, dude? One racer won't come out of the waiting room. What's taking so long? Let's go find him. What is taking so long? 
Why is he so scared to come out? Look at Mario's boots from beneath him, dude. They have, like, uh, spikes on them, so you can, like, you know, walk through the snow, and it disintegrates pretty quickly. I guess, I, w I don't want to say it melts, because it obviously doesn't melt, but it disappears. What about over this way? Oh, yeah. I don't know what's going to happen here. Oh, cool! Some more, uh, of these. Is there anything else? Nope, no hidden power moons or anything like that here. That's fine. Let me see if I, like, wall jump. Oh, yeah, nothing over here. All right. So this is the... This is the waiting room, or did they say the lock room? Because there definitely isn't any lockers here. Hey, yo, what's up, dude? Why don't you want to race? What's your problem, dog? Talk to me. I want to know. Race? I don't want to. The other races are too serious. I don't stand a chance. If someone else wanted to race, they would be welcome to take my place. I'm not racing. I'm never leaving this spot. Well, I'm going to possess you, dude. I forgot. Mario does that, you know? Look at him, dude. He's bouncing so much. Whoa, 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 whoa. Slow your horses. Let's go ahead and get these snowflakes. I love me some snowflakes. There you go. We got 28 out of 50 so far. Woohoo! Woohoo! Oh, yeah. We almost got all the onion rings there, but we didn't. All right. Slow down. Slow down, dude. He's here. Yeah, we did it. Hey, can we start the race? He doesn't want to talk to me. All right, what about you? Yeah, this is the guy that I need to talk to. Can we start the race? Finally, now we could start the race. Our frost for our fro our for frost frosted cake. I said forest, dude. I don't know why I said forest. Who would call something a frost frosted cake? That's a little redundant, you know, of the use frost frosted was stolen, so the prize will be a multi-moon. Are you ready to race now? Yes, we are. Let's do this. It's been a while since we've had a race. So we'll start with some training. That's good, man. I need the training. So it looks like it's going to be one of those uh, Goron races. We just got to roll around. Whoa, what the heck? Okay, so we just got to bounce back and forth. I guess not get in the, uh, uh, the snow. Because if you do that, you end up slowing down. And then just, you know, get around like this. What is this? Mario Kart? Woohoo! This is their version of Mario Kart, except without a cart, dude. These things are just bouncing back and forth. This is awesome, dude. I love this. All right, I can do it. Let's go ahead and start the race. How many races is it going to be? Bound Bowl Grand Prix. No line circuit class A. So is there more than just one race? There's a total of how many races? Seven? All right, this is it. I'm in fourth place. Here we go. We gotta do three laps of this. So it seems pretty easy. Look at that. Everybody bouncing. Woohoo! Oh, yeah, dude. I need to just get myself in first place. Somehow I'm in third place now. Very nice. Oh, no! What the heck? How did I end up there? I'm gonna die. I mean, I'm gonna lose. All right. Here we go. Faster. Faster, Mario. You could do this, my boy. You could catch up. There you go. I think I'm back in fourth place. Dude, there's no way I could catch up to first. How am I supposed to catch up to first place unless they magically... Oh, look at that. They do suck. They made them actually relatively easy. So I could definitely catch up to them. I don't know why at the beginning of this race, though, I ended up flying, like, off the screen. Oh, yeah. Look at that, dude. First place. Hurry up. We got one more ra lap to do. Oh, my gosh. That's probably the worst place to bounce on. There you go. And they even got that nice classic Mario Kart music out here. All right. Hurry up. Hurry up. We got to do this. Woohoo. Oh, yeah, there you go. That was perfect. That's how it's done. There you go. First place now. Oh, yeah. Just got to make sure that I don't... Okay, I got it right here. There you go. We did it. First place. A minute and ten seconds. I would say that's pretty horrible. I was in, like, fourth the entire time. Look at that. 27, 23, and 20. Imagine if I did it in under 20 seconds. I could have done it in under a minute. But still, first time we did it uh, here... So it's pretty good. What a race. You were like a supersonic snowman. Your prize is a multi-moon. That's actually pretty awesome because guess what, guys? With this multi-moon, I can make my way to the next kingdom. Look at these guys. They're so sad. They're like, you beat me fair and square. Hey, now this guy doesn't have to be so sad, you know, about uh, not losing or winning, I guess. He was, he was very depressed about it. He didn't even want to race anybody. But we got the multi-moon, so you all know what that means. We can make our way to the next kingdom of this game. I'm going to assume that the next kingdom is going to be a longer kingdom, considering, like, you know, 
we always have that kind of pattern short kingdom long kingdom short kingdom long kingdom so on and so forth it's funny enough the first whoa look at this everything is like lit again it's so cold but the sun is out wow this is pretty awesome i can actually see everything there's so much that i feel like i should explore but i don't know where to begin I mean, maybe we'll just come back. Hey, we can make our way to the next kingdom now. Is that really what you want to do? You want to make your way to the next kingdom. You don't even want to take a minute to explore anything here. I think I think he just wants to leave, guys. He doesn't want there to be any more in this episode. So I guess we're going to have to listen to this doofus. Oh, they even got the penguins from Mario 64. Look at them. They're chilling over there. Yo, I need to go say hello. I, I have to. I mean, this is a must. I need to just say hi. I don't care if they leave afterwards. I just gotta go say what's up. Oh my gosh, look at them, guys. Look at them. No, oh, they're leaving me. How dare you run away? Don't run away. Stay. No, they're flying away. What? They flew away. They actually kind of didn't look. They, they do look like the penguins from Mario 64. Just a little bit. But I don't know. I could very well be wrong. So, I guess we're going to end off the episode here. We'll go ahead and just make our way back to the Odyssey. Yep, there it is. We'll warp to the Odyssey. Don't worry. Don't worry, Cappy. We're going. We're leaving. Hold your horses, man. Don't worry about it, dog. So, uh, I guess we're going to go ahead and do that in the next episode. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed, once again, don't forget to drop a like. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.